Hi guys, Tom here, America's favorite hoarder. And on the 8th day of January 2024, Tom said let there be light, and there was light. Mm. Found this fine lamp, LED lamp, on the side of the road with a telescoping, telescoping and folding legs. Telescoping, I don't know what you want to call it. It goes up and down. Mm. So I said that would look great in my basement. Help me with my wall I'm working on. Mm -hmm. Help me see what I'm doing. Those two by fours I found, well, they're coming in handy. I gotta make another bracket for this corner here. I've got the original rock wall. Well, not wall, but foundation pillar. And I put this here to fasten the whatever I put from here to there. And over here, probably maybe I'll shape it the way the wall is. Speaking of whatever it is I put there, look what I just pulled out of the neighbor's dumpster. Mm. Yeah, two sheets. Mm. One foot, two foot, let's just call it four foot high by mm, 24 wide. And if that one's not it, that one is. So that's enough to maybe do that corner. That corner will be all no charge. Speaking of no charge, well, look what I've got. Mm, yep, another microwave. That makes seven for winter work. I've got the bottom of the bracket, which I will dispose of. The metal bracket, which hangs from the bottom of the cabinets in your kitchen. I would assume, you know what assume means. I'll fold that up. Mounting plate. Yes, that's what it's called. See? Mounting plate. It even tells you what it is. So, I'll add that to the pile that I've got <clears throat> over here. My big basement seems to be getting smaller by the week. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six microwaves over here. And like I said, that one makes seven. Can you ever have enough microwaves? No, I think not. I moved another LCD or LED TV over here. So I've got one, two, three, four, five. And I uh, accumulated another fan. So now I have two fans that work. That fan and that fan. This one's a little wobbly. I have yet to fix it, but it works fine. This one is not wobbly. It's needed to be put back together. Somebody knocks it over and this piece here sprung open and the lid well not the lid but the front cover fell off I don't know why people throw things away it took me five minutes to fix it and I've got another another fan this one could go upstairs in the summertime maybe if I don't use it down here I don't need a lot of fans picked up another toaster I don't know what you're toasting in this thing loaves of bread maybe and yes I saw that fan there but I wanted to check in. There are the four mm, tables. Mm, not tables. Bar stools. They may be kind of short for bar stools. Put that one and that one. And those two. On, on, I was wondering where I put that. Mm. I know it's only 9 o'clock in the morning, but I work the night shift now. So I go in at 10 at night and get home at 7 ish. So I have to take it easy. Don't want to drink too many before noon. It's going to be nap time. Oh, I also found a few more handy dandy containers. Look at this. A cat litter bucket. Not that my cat needs it, but I always need buckets for cans and scrap metal. And putting things on top of and sitting on when I'm working on things. And uh, I also found this nice milk crate looking thing. Nothing wrong with that at all. Not cracked or nothing. I just noticed still had the price on it. Four dollars and forty-five cents. It's a Tucker stacking crate. Yep. Thrown in the trash. And it's four dollars and forty-five cents I saved. But like I said, I wanted to check in, finding great things, not to dispose of anything or to waste anything. Piecemealing and cobbling my wall together. I've got my receptacles in. That one is wired to that one. 
I don't know if you can see it. I can't even see it. Where'd it go? And there it is, over there. Yep, see it, over there. So I've got that one, daisy chained. Yes, that's the correct term for that one. And then they had to buy some wire. So I've got the Romex up to the ceiling. And over here. I don't really know if I want to tackle attaching this. For this old thing, I might have the neighbor do it for me and stuff him 50 bucks. He's a nice guy. He always wants to help me. Mm. But again, for the third time, I wanted to check in. It's been quite uh, quite a few last days, a couple days. I can't seem to make room fast enough down here. I'm trying to get these walls done. And they're pretty much done. I just need to tape them and, well, tape them and mud them. And get the finish up there. Finish the inside of the window holdings. Whatever they're called. Not holdings, but window wells. And I'm going to use that, I think, over here, like I said. So, that's all for now. Never throw anything away. You never know when you're going to need it. Mm, it's so bright. I can't even see it. Turn that down. There. Pretty cool, huh? I actually like this one better than this one. I could put this one over in that corner. This could be a nice work light for me. But there you have it. Monday. January 8th, 2024. The hoarder's heaven. I got the shed on the outside filling up. I got the basement on the inside filling up. Plenty of projects to keep me busy. So I'll be busy. Thanks for watching. Keep hoarding. Mm. No. Hands, hands. One under there. Bye-bye.